Hello my fellow creators and welcome to my YouTube channel. Well, it is the second of the month, which means it is time for Show Us Your Sheet Load collaborators to share our version of this month's sheet load of card sketch. I am excited to be on the collaboration team this year and hope you will follow along with my fellow collaborators as we share our projects. You can find us by following the hashtag, which is hashtag SLCT Jan 22. Now the creative genius behind this sheet load of cards sketch is Alicia of Call Me Crafty Al. Alicia shares a new sheet load sketch with her subscribers every month. I have linked her channel in the description box below. Now as you can see the sheet load card sketch has an image of what the finished card could look like, a list of supplies needed, how many cards this sketch will yield, the dimensions for each of the pieces, just in case you want to make a single card, and alternatives, other ways you can use this sketch. On the second page, you'll see it shows how to cut your pattern paper. So this shows how to cut your 12 by 12 pattern paper. This shows how to cut your cardstock. Now, I am going to be using this beautiful pattern paper by Echo Park. It is the Be Mine Collection. And it has several beautiful papers, some nice stickers. I'm just going to show you what they look like really quick. And I'm going to make these in anticipation of Valentine's Day. And there was two of each sheet. So I'm going to go ahead and choose the three that I want to use for this month's sheet load. And those three are going to be these. And I can use either side. So let me cut these out and I'll be right back. All right, I've cut out all my pieces. I went ahead and stamped the sentiment and the image that I'm going to use. And this image and sentiment I got from the Simon Says Stamp Love Always stamp set. And then the inks I've used for the flower, I used Gina K Designs Soft Stone. And then for the sentiment, I used Gina K Designs Dusty Rose. Now I've just got to put my cards together.
As you can see, I colored a couple of these flowers, but when I put them up against the card, hmm, I felt they were a little washed out. I left the rest just stamped with the Gina K Designs soft stone ink and didn't color them in. And the foam squares I'm using for the image are just these roll of foam squares I picked up at Dollar Tree. They work really well. Now for the embellishments, I have these jewel stickers that I picked up at Dollar Tree as well. I'm going to see how those look. Alrighty, and then just to finish the cards, give them a little finishing touch, I will be using the few bits of leftover patterned paper and just add it to the inside of the cards. Alrighty, and here we have my nine cards with the January 2022 sheet load of card sketch. Make sure you follow along with all the other collaborators. I'll have the links to their channels in the description box below. Thanks for sticking around to the end. I'd be thrilled if you subscribed to my YouTube channel or followed me on any of my other social media platforms. As always, have a beautiful, safe, and creative day. Thanks for watching. Bye!